what is driving a lot of the sarcopenia. I think protein is important, but average protein intake is at about 1.2 grams per kilogram at the moment in America, which could be a little bit further optimized. But what's really the problem is the sedentary lifestyle and the lack of the stimulus. If you don't use it, you lose it. And something that I think is often not appreciated is that as we're aging, we're not just losing muscle mass, we're losing quality muscle. And we get a shift from type two fast switch fibers. Fast switch means fast to fatigue. We can produce power really quickly, produce force really quickly and react really quickly. Whereas the slow twitch are more slower to fatigue, more endurance muscle fibers. And as we age, we get this reduction in the fast switch and relative increase in slow twitch. That is what leads to us having less power and being more at risk of falls. Because when you fall and you have to catch yourself, mm -hmm. you have to produce force really quickly through the knee, through the hip. And this is critical. If you look at masters athletes, athletes that are in their 50s, 60s, 70s, sometimes early 80s that have been physically active throughout their life, they can attenuate a lot of that muscle loss. This is not just a normal part of aging. It is from living a sedentary lifestyle and not having that stimulus there.